I want my lawyer. This trial is fixed. Chris, keep it down. You're just getting them mad. Chris Shepard, Cody Miller, you stand accused of meeting a <gasps> lad with checks, wearing red uh. and orange in the same outfit, and generally having Ew. absolutely no fashion taste whatsoever. Emily, can't you put in a good word for us? Sorry, guys. I'm afraid your sentence is going to add up to... Six. What answer did you get? 6,352. You? Uh, somewhere in between. That's it. I'm never studying with either of you again. Emily, we've been studying for two hours. I think we peaked 20 minutes ago. Yeah, maybe we should take a break. You're right. Forget math. Let's move on to history. Oh, I think you gotta lighten up. Guys, you will not believe what Mags just made for me. Look. Mags, that's gorgeous. You made that? Yeah. I just remodeled her old dress. Mags, please let me pay you for this. No way. Do you have any idea how much a dress like this costs? How much? A hundred bucks? <laughs> Try five times that amount. Easy. Five hundred dollars? And if it's a designer original, even more. Could be, what, thousands? For one dress? Mm -hmm. That's nuts. Wait a minute. Let me see that. Thanks. Do you know what this means? You wanted to make one in your size, Trixie? <laughs> I wanted to make a lot of them, because we're going to sell them and make a fortune. Thanks. We are going into the fashion biz. This will make me famous. This will make me rich. Famous. Rich. Edison High. Of course, to me, so is this. The food stinks. We got a vice principal you don't want to mess with. And the school papers run by a couple of real sick puppies. It was all pretty boring until this new girl arrived, and I thought, oh, come on, look at her. You know what I thought. Anyway, she said we should do our own paper to show what Edison High is really like. So now I'm stuck sharing the newspaper office with these two idiots, my best friends, Chris and Mags, and the new girl, Emily. Oh, and by the way, the guy drawing the pictures? That's me. Student bodies. Hey, jump out of bed. Big bell ringing in my head. Gotta make it there from here. real life. It's high school. Ah! Chris, you don't know the first thing about fashion. <laughs> if he did, he wouldn't be wearing this sweater-shirt combo. <laughs> this isn't about fashion. It's about negotiation and deals. Mags will make the clothes. And what will you do, Chris? As I was saying, Mags will make the clothes, and I'll handle all the business details. Oh, what details? For the fashion show. A fashion show? Mags, that would be fantastic. We'll have the show right here at the station. Dino loves me. And we've already got models. Right, Emily? I'd love to, but I can't. I've got too much studying to do. Okay, yeah. We'll get other people to model. People with lousy grades. <laughs> Mags. I can see it now. Your name spelled out in black on a red velvet curtain. Designs by Mags. Margaret. Okay, Margaret. No way. Marguerite. Yeah, whatever. Partners? Partners. Hey, are you guys sure you know what you're getting yourselves into? Please. <laughs> sure, it means we'll be famous. Rich. Famous. Rich. Rich. Uh. Ooh. Emily, please change your mind about doing my fashion show. I've just got the perfect outfit for you. I'd love to, Mags, but I just don't have the time. Why not? Well, I have to write my help me column. I have to edit student bodies. I have yeah, to... Yeah, that's what you have to do. What do you want to do? Honestly, I want to have a little fun. I'm tired of being nice, reliable Emily. I want to do something wild, something crazy, something totally unpredictable.
unpredictable. I need a break. <laughs> You know, this is just a guess, but it sounds like somebody could use a vacation. Yeah, well, you can't take a vacation from high school. <laughs> Give me a minute. Uh, em. Em. Model for Mags. This is your week off from all responsibility. Oh, who's going to do all my work? I will, okay? For this week, I am you, and you can be me. Really? You do that for me? Of course. That is so sweet. So thoughtful. You are the best. I can do it. Great. We are going to have so much fun. Oh, Cody, um, you know, Emily had promised to do my column for me. That's right, I did. So, if you're her... Yeah, yeah, okay. Bring it on. Oh, my God. <laughs> Thank you. You are the best friend ever. Wow. Oh, Grace, Grace! <laughs> if you do the fashion show, Cody will write your astrology column for you. You will? What? No, wait a second. I didn't... That's what I would do. Sucker! Hand it on over, Grace. Oh! We are going to have the best time! You are so nice. Yeah, guys, could you just, could you help? Could you help me with the... You're a pushover, Miller. You're gonna wind up doing everybody's work and nobody will appreciate it. Leave him alone. He's a nice boy. You hear that? Forget it, Miller. Once they call you nice, it's all over. Huh? Mr. Miller. Most amoeba don't float around on inner tubes and sip daiquiris. Hey, great news. Morgan's a go. Go ahead. Tell her the rest. What rest? Oh, uh, just a few details. Nothing a creative genius like you should worry about. Okay, Max. You got yourself a photographer for the fashion show. When should I come for my fitting? And what am I fitting you for? The outfit Shepard said you'd make for me? Pink leather. Chris? Well, I, uh, I had to promise her something. <laughs> Chris Shepard, I regret ever, ever getting into a partnership with you at all. Told you so. No, I would not say I told you so. If you're gonna be me, do it right, okay? Thanks. you have nothing to worry about. I, I've placed advertisements, and Dino's got the station completely sold out for Friday night. Friday? This Friday? Yeah, well, you can do it, Max. Yeah. We'll all pitch in and help. Better? Yeah. That sounded like me. Oh, Max, you can show me your sketches at lunchtime, and I'll tell you which ones I like. Uh, Morgan, uh, we'll, we'll talk about this later. I am so looking forward to the premiere of the Morgan Collection. Mm. Uh -huh. The Morgan Collection? I can explain. Uh -huh. Don't bother, Chris. You're fired. Now that's perfectly understandable. But we've got a lot of work to do, so let's just forget this fired stuff and move on. Come on. How long are you gonna stay mad at this face? <laughs> I'm going to kill you, Mags. You can't kill him. Mm, you're right. But I can do this. Chris! Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Okay, good. As of this second, the Abernathy collection is none of your business. Uh She'll get over this, right? You're a... Oh, it's my job. You're a dead man, Shepard. What she said. Ah! 